हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बेसिकली इंट्रोड्यूस टू ए न्यू ऑडियो एडिटर दैट आई डेवलप्ड इन साइड रियक्ट चेयर्स एंड आई बेसिकली यूज एफ एम एम पी जी वेब असेंबली लाइब्रेरी लेम जे एस एंड वेब सर्फर डॉट जे एस वी आई यूज थ्री ओपन सोर्स लाइब्रेरीज गाइज टू एक्चुअली बिल्ड आउट दिस हंड्रेड परसेंट क्लाइंट साइड फुल्ली वन पेज साउंड एडिटर राइट इन द ब्राउजर इट्स यूजिंग जावा स्क्रिप्ट इन रियक्ट चेयर्स सो यू कैन जस्ट सी लाइक द demo that i'm running it on local host 5173 locally inside my machine and this will look something like this there is this simple interface you will actually want to select your audio file all extensions are supported it should be a it should be a valid sound file so there is an option choose file button so basically you will simply select that option and just go to your directory wherever your file are stored so i will simply select my output.mp3 file you can just see here it is 15 minutes 32 second long so it will actually create a wave form guys using wave surfer.js and it will actually show you a nice little timeline where these wave forms will be shown and basically here we have the trimmer right here you can control this using the mouse here you will see that very easily we can trim any portion in the audio that we don't want and uh, like this so we actually coded this application inside the react js guys so you will basically see we have used lame js which is actually a open source mp3 encoder library we have used react js for this project react audio react tom wave surfer.js we also use ffmpg web assembly in the background to actually carry out the conversion so if you need this project guys the link is given in the description you can directly purchase the full source code with full directory structure and you will get this full direct full application you can basically run this application uh, after you purchase it from my website you will be automatically be redirected to google drive where you will actually get the zip file you just need to extract the zip file and this will actually contain all this jsx code this Re react js code and basically you can see that i am running this application on local host 5173 so after you do, uh, extract it go to the folder and just run this command npm run dev so it will actually start the wheat server which will actually host your react js application it is basically develop guys with the latest version of react node so it will basically compatible with all the versions of node and react with all the older versions as well so if you reload that you will look something like this you will actually choose your audio file and uh, it will now create the audio wave form using wave surfer.js so now guys let's suppose uh, we can control the bar width you will see that Use using this slider, we can basically control the bar width. You can, if you want larger, you can do that. You can even control the height as well. If you don't want higher height, like this, you can control the height as well. So all the things are customizable, guys. Using these sliders, it makes it dynamic. So totally depends upon the functionality. Zoom level, if you want to zoom it at a different level, you can even do that as well. so i just want to do this like this so bar gap also you can control like this so it is almost 15 minutes 5 second long so basically uh, you can just see it created this awesome little wave form and uh, uh, the primary objective guys is to remove the background noise and also remove the silence so basically we can select this portion and delete this portion as well or trim it so it's a audio trimmer guys and now let me show you the trimmer portion so this is actual trimmer portion so let's suppose i want to trim this portion awesome ultimate advanced so this is a trimmer right here and basically we can select it using our mouse so it will start from this and you can just see here 25 second to 45 second so this is your starting time and this is your ending time and here you can basically uh, have this option of trim song so if you click on trim you can basically see your video has been successfully trimmed and now it only contain 20 second you can see that you can play this you can see the audio file is successfully trimmed 
and now you can simply download this by clicking on download your file is successfully downloaded so this is a way for the no server side code is involved so only if you upload 20 second is there in the audio you can see that the audio was successfully cut using the selection that you selected the starting time and the end time so basically it did that portion pretty well so in this way guys you can carry out the conversion process just select your file if you want to trim your audio without using any third party software just select that it will create the waveform so this is the application guys if you are interested the link is given in the description So this is your trimmer will be there. You can go to any location in the audio, whichever portion that you want. These things are written right here. You can see 60 second. This is one minute, five second. The timing is written right here. You can also go to a particular location by using this also. So this is your trimmer which is available to you. You can navigate to the location where you want to trim the portion, cut the audio file. Let's suppose I want to trim 2 minutes 5 seconds up till 250. So the length will be around about 45 seconds. Click on trim and now you can see uh, almost 45 seconds you will see the uh, audio was successfully cut you can play Comment this audio you want file ima well, images right? to check my uh, it will auto my inbox and automatic it's a very minimalistic guys audio trimmer audio cutter application right in the browser which is built using react chairs you can download your you can even basically have a second option playback speed you can control the speed of the audio if you now do this it will play very slowly so you can basically increase the speed decrease the speed depending upon that image will be converted to webp format you will see that so in this way so the next thing is also so if you download this format you want an image to convert let's suppose i want let's suppose i want so the audio is successfully downloaded guys so this is a great uh, application guys if you are interested the link is given in the description it's a audio editor built inside react chairs and it uses uh, three libraries first is we are using ffmpg library if you don't know about ffmpg it's a open source uh, audio and video processing library and we are actually using it in the browser so it's a command line library built for windows linux and mac but we are using this package ffmpg webassembly which allows ffmpg to be used in the browser to actually make these awesome applications so this is their github repo you can check out their library and also we are using this library which is a mp3 encoder which is lame.js so actually it is used to actually export the mp3 file after you make them modify the changes you download the mp3 file so we are actually encoding the mp3 or audio files using this library and the third library guys wave surfer which is a very important library whenever you select your audio file it actually constructs the waveform using this open source javascript library which allows you to construct your audio visualization for creating interactive customizable waveform so whenever you select the input audio file it actually creates these audio files so it actually create these awesome files right here whenever you select any audio file it construct this audio waveforms so coming back to the code guys you will actually get this full source code after you purchase it from my website from google drive you will get a zip file you just need to extract the content and start the project and uh, various uh, app jsx if you see basically all the content is there so it is built using the valid JSX and JavaScript. You can see that each component has have different files associated with it. So this is the main audio editor component which is coded in JSX. 
so this is the main component this is the waveform component so if you want to deploy this project guys we have this simple command npm run build command as well you can, if you want to deploy this inside your domain name let's suppose if you are building it in your own website if you want to deploy this application what you can do if you are running it you can see that close this just run this command npm run build it will actually build your application it will actually create a new directory called as build directory dist folder it will create and it will actually create the minified css and the javascript code and this is your index.html file so you can directly upload these files to your hosting platform and actually uh, you can see it is built for production so you can run locally or you can build it for production if you are developing it for your own domain name you can easily do this so this is audio editor guys in react.js timeline audio editor and it is built using ffmpg lame.js and wavesurfer.js and if you are interested guys the link is given in the description thank you very much for watching this video and uh, i will be seeing you guys in the next video until then thank you very much